Metal carbon dioxide complexes are coordination complexes that contain carbon dioxide ligands. Aside from the fundamental interest in the coordination chemistry of simple molecules, studies in this field are motivated by the possibility that transition metals might catalyze useful transformations of CO2. This research is relevant both to organic synthesis and to the production of solar fuels that would avoid the use of petroleum-based fuels. Topic. Structural trends Carbon dioxide binds to metals in only a few ways. The bonding mode depends on the electrophilicity and basicity of the metal center. Most common is the eta 2 co 2 coordination mode as illustrated by Arrestas complex, Ni CO2 PCY3, 2, which was the first reported complex of CO2. This square planar compound is a derivative of Ni with a reduced CO2 ligand. In rare cases, CO2 binds to metals as a Lewis base through its oxygen centers, but such adducts are weak and mainly of theoretical interest. A variety of multinuclear complexes are also known often involving Lewis basic and Lewis acidic metals, e.g. metallocarboxylate salts C5H2 Fe CO2 CO2 K+. In multinuclear cases, compounds containing more than one metal, more complicated and more varied coordination geometries are observed. One example is the unsymmetrical compound containing four rhenium centers, CO 5 Rico 2 Re CO 4 2. Carbon dioxide can also bind to ligands on a metal complex versus just the metal, e.g., by converting hydroxy ligands to carbonato ligands. Topic. Reactions Transition metal carbon dioxide complexes undergo a variety of reactions. Metallocarboxylic acids protonate at oxygen and eventually convert to metal carbonyl complexes. LNMCO2 minus plus 2H plus LNMCO plus plus H2 of this reaction is relevant to the potential catalytic conversion of CO2 to fuels. Topic: <coughs> Carbonation of metal carbon bonds. Topic. <coughs> Insertion into CUC bonds N-heterocyclic carbon NHC supported qui complexes catalyze carboxylation of organoboronic esters. The catalyst forms in situ from copper-1 chloride, an NHC ligand, and cotbu. Copper tert butoxide can transmetallate with the organoboronic ester to generate the qui C bond, which intermediate can insert into CO2 smoothly to get the respective carboxylate. Salt metathesis with cotbu releases product and regenerates catalyst scheme 2. Apart from transmetallation, there are other approaches forming CUC bond. CH functionalization is a straightforward and atom economic method. Base can help deprotonate acidic CH protons and form CUC bond. Phenanthrolene CU PR3 catalyst effect CH carboxylation on terminal alkynes together with cesium carbonate. NHC CUH species to deprotonate acidic proton to affect carboxylation of terminal alkynes. CUH species were generated from CUF and organosilanes. The carboxylate product was trapped by silyl fluoride to get silyl ether. For non-acidic CH bonds, directed methylation with IBU3 Al TMP Li is adopted followed by transmetallation with copper to get CUC bond. 
allylic CH bonds and phenyl CH bonds got carboxylated with this approach by Hu and co-workers, carbometallation to alkynes and alenes using organozinc and organoaluminum reagents followed by transmetallation to copper is also a strategy to initiate carboxylation. Trimethylaluminium is able to insert into unbiased aliphatic internal alkynes with syn fashion directed by ether directing group. Vinyl copper complexes are formed by transmetallation and carboxylation is realized with a similar pathway giving tetrasubstituted aliphatic vinyl carboxylic acids. In this case, regioselectivity is controlled by the favor of six-membered aluminum ring formation. Furthermore, carboxylation can be achieved on winamides and alanamides using less reactive dimethyl zinc via similar approach. <laughs> Insertion in PDC bonds In the presence of palladium acetate under 1 to 30 bars of CO2, simple aromatic compounds convert to aromatic carboxylic acids. A PSIP pincer ligand 5 promotes carboxylation of aline without using pre-functionalized substrates. Catalyst regeneration, et 3 all was added to do transmetallation with palladium. Catalyst is regenerated by the following beta-H elimination. Apart from terminal alenes, some of internal alenes are also tolerated in this reaction, generating allyl carboxylic acid with the yield between 54% and 95%. This system was also applied to 1,3-Dene, generating carboxylic acid in 1,2-addition fashion. In 2015, Iwasawa et al. reported the germanium analog and combined CO2 source together with hydride source to formate salts. Palladium has shown huge power to catalyze CH functionalization. If the PDC intermediate in carboxylation reaction comes from CH activation, such methodology must promote metal catalyzed carboxylation to a much higher level in utility. Iwasawa and co-workers reported direct carboxylation by styrenal CH activation generating coumarin derivatives. Benzene rings with different electronic properties and some heteroaromatic rings are tolerated in this reaction with yield from 50% to 90%. CH activation was demonstrated by crystallography study. Insertion by RHC bonds Similar to copper 1 iodide chemistry mentioned above, RH -I complexes can also transmetallate with aryl boronic esters to get aryl rhodium intermediates, to which CO2 is inserted, giving carboxylic acids. Later, Iwasawa et al. described CH carboxylation strategy. RH -I undergoes oxidative addition to aryl CH bond followed by transmetallation with alkyl aluminum species. RRH -I regenerates by reductive elimination releasing methane. RRH -I attacks CO2 then transmetallates with aryl boronic acid to release the boronic acid of product, giving final carboxylic acid by hydrolysis. Directed and non directed versions are both achieved. Iwasawa and co workers developed RH -I catalyzed carbonation reaction initiated by RHH insertion to vinylarenes. In order to regenerate reactive RHH after nucleophilic addition to CO2, photocatalytic proton coupled electron transfer approach was adopted. In this system, excess amount of diethylpropylethylamine works as sacrificial electron donor scheme 5. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Insertion by NiC bond. Carboxylation of benzyl halides has been reported. The reaction mechanism is proposed to involve oxidative addition of benzyl chloride to Ni0. 
The Ni-2 benzyl complex is reduced to Ni I, e by zinc, which inserts CO2 delivering the nickel carboxylate. Reduction of the Ni I carboxylate to Ni zero releases the zinc carboxylate scheme six. Similarly, such carboxylation has been achieved on aryl and benzyl pavalate, alkyl halides, and allyl esters. <laughs> 